What's up, people? I am back for another video. Oh my god, of course. <laughs> of course, as usual. Anyway. Um, but today's planned video is gonna just be like a rant. Because I've been noticing this the last few weeks with Warner Brothers. Like, the news that they want to get Taika Waititi. It's like, that's what really brought on this video. Like, it's really showing me that Warner Brothers does not want to be... They, they're trying to be MCU so fucking bad. I mean, it's one thing when you got Josh Sweden, but then you had to hire James Gunn. Whatever. Whatever we think of Guardians. I mean, a, or the Suicide Squad. They're clearly trying to be the MCU. It is pathetic. And I'm not talking about universe... Because MCU's not the first one to do a shared universe on pop so that's not what i'm saying they're clearly in tone like they basically the reason they probably want taika is so they can have their own thor ragnarok basically that's all they fucking want it's it's really pissing me off because warner brothers doesn't understand what made dc different was that it was different from marvel but no they not it's not even them trying to be marvel they're not trying to be like you know, the rainy era Spider-Man films or those the Fox X-Men movies. They're not trying to be that. They're trying to be the MCU so fucking bad. In tone, we gotta make everything jokey. It, it's really pathetic. This is the company that, you know, used to make movies like Watchmen, Batman 89. We're going from that to just these basically pseudo-MCU movies just with a DC logo on it. It's really crazy. Like Guardian, the... Well, that's what the Suicide Squad was. It was just a Guardians movie with an R rating. It just was... The, it, what happened? A lot of their best DCU films are the ones that don't feel like I'm watching an MCU film. Like, look at Justice League. That should have been their fucking lesson right there. They should have learned their lesson after fucking Justice League. That you gotta be DC. Be your own thing. But I guess they fucking didn't. Because they still got ended up getting James Gunn. Now they're trying to get Taika Waititi. Like I said, they want their own Thor Ragnarok. For no, oh, the guy who ruined Thor. They want to get that guy. What are you doing, Warner Brothers? You already didn't let Zack and David Ayer have their visions. But let's let the Marvel guys just come in and get let them do what the fuck they want. That is the fundamental problem I'm having with this. They're letting, like, these MCU guys come in and kind of do what the fuck they want, but their own homegrown guys. No. That, that's bullshit. You're just trying to ride the wave. You're not even trying to be DC anymore. You're just trying to be the MCU, and it's pathetic. And this is why I'm happy some of your shit's flopping, because you're not getting it. Zack Snyder's Justice League should have shown you. Or Joker. One of those two movies should have shown you when you're pure DC, your movies are phenomenal. But that's not what you want to do. You want to be the pseudo MCU, and it's not going to work because the MCU already exists. People will just watch that. And this is why making trying to make Suicide Squad like the Guardians wasn't work at the end of the day because people, even if they liked it, will just be like, "All right, I'm just going to watch Guardians. I don't need to watch a a parody, basically a parody or a copy of of, of Guardians when they can just watch the real thing." It's the same thing with them trying to be. Make Justice League Avengers. And that's why that shit flopped. No one will watch... They'll just watch the Avengers. They don't need to watch the pseudo-Avengers with Justice League. Like, that. this is what they don't understand. The movies that stand the test of time are the ones that don't feel like Marvel. But it, it's... That's what they want to do. And it, it's pathetic. So, this isn't the DCU I signed up for back in 2013. So, fuck them. As usual, you know how I end my videos. Fuck Warner Brothers. This video wasn't going to be long. I just needed to get this rant out there. It's really pathetic what WB is trying to do. They're not even trying to be their own thing anymore. It, it's it's like you thought after 27, after really after the Justice League flop, they would understand. But I guess not. Because they feel like you got to bring that MCU flavor, which no one asked for. Any real DC fan, anyway, didn't ask for that. Um, it, I don't get it. Like, y'all, like, once again, their best movies are the ones that are their own tone, that feel like this is pure DC. That's why the look at the Nolan trilogy, even though the, some of the Batman stuff in it isn't great, but that's DC in tone. Same with movies like Watchmen, Zack Snyder's Justice League, Man of Steel, even to an extent Aquaman. Those movies worked 
because those movies felt like I was watching a DC movie. I'm not saying inherently just because it's MCU because it's lighthearted. No. It's when you're so, like, trying to be that tone. Suicide Squad was just a Guardians movie. Even the song choices they played in that movie very much were songs like, I could see this in a Guardians movie. That's the problem. It's like they didn't under they're not understanding that. Their best movies are the ones that are pure DC comics. This isn't... I'm sorry, even if you like the Suicide Squad, I almost don't... That doesn't feel like a DC movie. It feels like a Marvel movie with an R rating. MCU movie. Because it's a Guardians movie. Like, that's what it was. And that's fine if you like it, but for me, DC is not the MCU. And it needs to stop trying to be it. Start going back to being your own thing. Because when you're just trying to be the DC version of the MCU, it's not going to work. Because... Once again, people will just watch the act, the actual MC. They don't want to watch a dollar version and win it. And that's what the MC, the DC is trying to be now, and it's sad. So I just wanted to get that ran out there. Um, tomorrow I will probably do a wrestling-related video. And then, of course, the, the Def Leppard video. And then uh, Friday I got it. You know how I did the problem with female characters? I'm going to do that with, well, with black characters. I said this a while ago. I was going to do that. But yeah, I'm going to do it on Friday. So, but as usual, cheers. <coughs> but, as usual, fuck Warner Brothers. Fuck Disney. <coughs> Obviously, fuck LeBron. Fuck uh, Kevin Smith. Fuck a lot of Hollywood. <coughs> but I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Peace.